Hey guys, welcome to my vlog. That's vehicular log. I spent a lot of time in my truck driving back and forth to school a couple days a week right now. And the fall is going to be a lot more. But I uh, figured I would take this time to talk to you guys. Oops. If I can get my camera to stay. Oh. It's currently, man, I'm running late today. I was already running late, and then I had to stop and get some gas, too, so that didn't help. Uh, I figured I would take this time to talk to you guys, and it's probably going to be mostly me screaming at other drivers, actually. Stupid idiots. in a nice pink cup. <laughs> oh man, this is not looking good. I'm actually not late for class per se, but uh, I try to leave pretty early to avoid traffic because traffic gets really bad at a certain time. So try to leave early enough to avoid that but oh, looks like I might not get that opportunity today yeah sure come on out usually I listen to music or if I have an audio book I listen to that on the way but I don't have an audio book and I don't want to listen to music because copyright bull crap actually uh, just finished an audiobook, uh, Making Habits, Breaking Habits. I forgot who the author is. I could look it up on my phone, but I'm not going to do that because I'm driving. I'm trying to go really slow around this turn so I don't send the camera flying. state always check your blind spots always check your blind spots people and use your damn blinker hey, like, like that guy just did good job uh, that's probably not a good position for the camera I don't know if you can even hear me but my dash is so inclined, it's kind of hard to find. Maybe I can put it right here. How's that? Is that any better? That's pretty nice, but I don't think it's going to stay there. Because it's kind of teeter-tottering. The slightest curve is going to send it flying. I don't even know if my battery will last. Yeah, okay, I guess my battery will last. This is like almost an hour long trip, so I won't upload the entire video. I'll edit it down first because I'm sure it's gonna be, I'm sure it's gonna be a little quiet at times. I can't talk for an hour straight. Doesn't look too bad over here right now. Of course, I'm not to the bad part yet. Had me a nice breakfast this morning. Egg white omelet, turkey, spinach, red peppers. I prefer green peppers, but I didn't have any. A little bit of cheese. Those of you who know me know that I love to work out. Unfortunately, I haven't worked out in Kappas. Popo already got people. Look, what the hell? Looks like a cop has another cop pulled over. But I know that's what. I think they're looking for something. Yeah, 
this. See, when you're passing an on ramp, you move over so people can merge into the freaking interstate. That's easy peasy. That's how you avoid all these damn traffic jams. So I haven't worked out in, it's been over a year, I think. Been pretty tight on money. And it is expensive to work out and to eat healthy. To buy supplements, vitamins, and yada, yada, yada. It adds up, especially the way I work out and eat. Cause I get big. But, uh, Today, I'm going to start back in the gym. Uh, I'm actually a little nervous because my strength is nowhere near where it used to be. And I'm going to look like a fool lifting a little bit of weight. Hey, military guy. It's like army. Anybody on, oh man, I already see it up there. Damn. Damn. There's this one spot that gets bad, and then when I get further up, it's even worse. Well, I wouldn't say it's worse up ahead. I would say it's worse right here, because this is only two lane, but further up, it's four lanes, so. It's easier for traffic to flow. Thing about driving, defensive driving people, defensive driving. Keep your head on swivel, check your mirrors constantly. Or not constantly, but frequently. Be aware of your surroundings, where other vehicles are. Some new sunglasses, things are broken. They don't fit right on my head anymore. Anyway, that's freaking song stuck in my head. I was listening to it right before I started the camera up. Come flying up behind you, and when you're in the fast lane, you check your mirrors, you check your blind spots, people. And you use your damn blinker. Blinker is the easiest fucking thing to use. The easiest fucking thing, you, I swear, one finger. You don't even have to click it all the way, because most of them you just move it a little bit, and it it does it. It's so freaking easy. I can steer with one hand and still use my blinker. I use my damn pinky for my blinker. It's so easy. Why can't people do that? People don't need to be driving, I swear. Oh man, look at the traffic behind me too. A bunch of them. Everybody's heading up here at the same time. <laughs> oh. Let's try to stay ahead of them, shall we? Oh man, I'm just expecting the camera to go flying soon. Just one strategic bump. I'll have to hold it whenever I go over a bridge, I guess. It's a little crooked, but that's alright. As long as it didn't fall. 
a hurry, too. Still, man, I hate traffic. I heard it. Traffic, traffic. Looking for my chaps, still feeling kind of car sick. There's a Ford Maverick. That's a million dollar rhyme right there. I don't know if y'all have seen that movie. Uh, Malibu's Most Wanted. And look at this crap. Look at this crap. What the? Man, look at that big gap up there. Look at that big gap. Why are y'all going so slow? Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't get over because. But give me any space. Can I get over in front of this? I'm gonna try to get over in front of this guy. Just like get it. Come on. Somebody else pulled over in front of me. Oh man, I hate traffic. All right, y'all just give them some space. Let them merge in. Come on. Anybody need to get over, get out of the way? No? Ooh. Okay, he's good. <laughs> Look close for a second. Okay, it's not too bad. We're getting through here. Bumpy ride. I'm sure y'all can see it in the camera. There's a kind of, there's a little bit of a wobble. That's not the road. That's my tires. <laughs> Pretty sure it's my tires. I need to get some new ones, but priorities. As college student again, my money is going to college. All right, yeah, uh, man, there's a lot of traffic up there, too. I, I swear, I cannot wait until driverless cars are everywhere. I don't think anybody should drive. I mean, I like to drive, but I hate driving with other drivers. I would give up my right to drive just so I wouldn't have to drive with these other idiots on the road. And you got people who, man, it could be pouring down rain and they won't turn their damn lights on. You can't even see the idiots and they won't turn on the fucking lights on. What the hell? I mean, stupid, stupid. <laughs> oh, don't keep going there. Damn, I need a haircut. My hair grows so fast. Oh, that's gross. Whew. At least he used a 
blinker. And I hate these people that just swerve over in front of you, don't even use the freaking blinker. Yeah, so I'm going to be uploading this on my Slice of Jason channel. Y'all may know of my other, I have a gaming channel, which I'm currently trying to get a partnership so that I can get a little more networking, get some more views, more subscribers, and uh, some companies will, uh, when you have a partnership, some companies will give you item, you know, products that you can give away to your viewers. What is that little flashing thing? I don't even know what that is. It's been forever since I've used this camera. It's not an HD camera, I think. Yeah, it is. Well, <laughs> high quality. Not HD, but high quality. <laughs> HQ. <laughs> So if I get that partnership, I'll be able to give away some prizes on my game channel. So y'all should uh, y'all should check that out. Look at this dumbass right here, man. I hate people like that. Just swerving in between cars. You think you're slick until you miscalculate. Oh shit. <laughs> That was gonna happen. <laughs> Just so you know, I got my sunglasses on so you can't see, but my eyes are on the road the whole time I'm fooling with this camera here. Just so you know, oh, more traffic. Oh man, this is looking rough up here. Yep. Damn it, I hate traffic. Ooh. I hate traffic. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I mean, you can see the Superman emblem right there. I've got Superman all over my truck. You can't see my steering wheel, but it's on my steering wheel too. And my floor mats. And my tag. Spots. I don't know if y'all know which song is stuck in my head or not. Hey, we're stopping again. Yay! Yay! Love it! Not. Oh man, this workout's gonna be rough today. Sunglasses are like, I don't need these right now. How much 
much would they like 15 maybe 20 bucks at Walmart and I've had them for years oh crap look at all that damn track At least it's still moving, sort of, <laughs> I think. It's like it might be moving. But yeah, these sunglasses. I got sidetracked. Gray sunglasses, I've had them for several years, but they're starting to fall apart now. I don't know if y'all can see this, but there's uh, this rubber stuff on the inside. So you have UV protection all around your eye and it hug your face. Well, it's starting to fall off on this side. And plus, they're kind of breaking in some places. But I'd say I got my worth from them. I had good value from them because I've had them several years and they're just now starting to fall apart. And they were cheap as hell. Guys, don't spend a lot of money on sunglasses. That's ridiculous. Because chances are you're going to lose them. Somebody's going to sit on them. Gonna fall off your head in the toilet. You're not going to want to pick them up. <laughs> one time, one time I spent a lot of money on sunglasses. Okay, come on, people. One time I spent a lot of money on sunglasses. And that's when I was, oh, look at the damn traffic. Okay, now this is a bad. Man, I hate traffic, I hate, it. I hate traffic. Hate it. And give us some damn bullet trains over here or something. Maglevs. And gonna creep along now anyway what I was saying one time one time I spent a lot of money on sunglasses and that's when I was in the Navy and we were deployed to Italy Siganella Italy but uh oh, we had so much money over there because we had overseas pay hazard pay uh, I don't even remember all the different pays we had because it's been a while. But, uh, I mean, I had like 900 extra dollars a month on top of what I was getting paid before. And I was young, didn't know anything about saving money, so I just blew it all. Fucking idiot. Save your money, people. Trust me, save your money. Better than that, invest it. Invest your money. If you got a bunch of money just sitting in the bank, it's not earning that much interest. Find some good stock or something, put it in there. Invest in some business or something. Make you some money. Anyway, I wish I had more money to invest. I have a little bit of money invested, but it's, I mean, it's not a lot. So I don't really see much of a difference in the price has changed. But uh, most of my stuff is invested in future technology. So it's not worth anything yet. But when they start mass producing that shit, man, ooh, I'm gonna be rich, bitch. Rich, bitch. But uh, damn this traffic. Oh man, I wish I'd gotten out of the house a little bit earlier. But no oh, man. I didn't sleep for crap last night. The weather was really bad. <clears throat> Kept waking me up. Loud crackling thunder outside my window. Oh. Dog was freaking out. I don't know, I might 
might get there right at time. Maybe. Man, it's ridiculous. Ooh. And we're just fucking stopping. Shit! I hate traffic! Traffic, traffic. Looking for what you have to do. Feeling kind of cost. It gets a four in the I didn't even finish my story a while ago about the sunglasses. <laughs> Got distracted. But yeah, I spent... Uh, like 400 and close to 500 euro which is more than the dollar so it was over 500 dollars American dollars that I spent on some sunglasses when I was in Italy and they, they were nice sunglasses don't get me wrong they were uh, some Oakleys man blue oh they look sick Badass sunglasses, but uh, came home with them, and I was I was stationed in Maine, and I left them in a the girl's car, and like that week, like she had just got her driver's license, and she wrecked her car, and I never saw those sunglasses again. Five hundred something dollars, right out the window. I was so pissed. So don't spend a lot of money on sunglasses. I mean, I don't think you should spend that much money on any accessory like that. Something that's really not, I mean, something that can be done for a lot less money. I mean, even if I was, I could be a billionaire and I wouldn't spend that much money on uh, pretty much anything. I mean, clothes, I'm not going to go out and spend hundreds of dollars on pants, maybe suits, I'll buy some nice suits just because they look nice. Professional. It's gotta have that business attire, you know. I give me some nice suits, but uh, even a house, man. I wouldn't buy some expensive mansion, some big ass mansion with 50 rooms that I'm never gonna use. That's just more cleaning. Of course, you can hire cleaners, but still, just give me uh, the decent size, you know. Medium income level house, maybe four bedrooms, three or four bedrooms, a couple bathrooms, give me a pool outside, decent yard. Something with an office.
Make it on time. Anyway, nah, 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 nah. Mm -hmm. Popo. Not after me. Who's he after? Who's he after? <laughs> that car right there is like, oh shit. I thought he was after him. You're good, bro. You're good. Another thing about defensive. One thing that's, that's hard to accomplish with defensive driving is the two car length rule. Yeah, it's, it's safer to have two car lengths between you you and the person in front of you so you'll have time to stop but you can't do that especially in traffic man because if you give the space somebody else is going to whip in there and then you got less than a car space it's ridiculous man, he's still he's still chasing somebody almost there Oh man, so I got two classes, and then I'm going to go to the calf, give me, a, give me a grub on, can't work out on an empty stomach, or I can, but not as empty as I'm going to be, because I ate at like 5.30, so it's going to be, it's going to be after 10 o'clock by the time I get out of there, out of class. Come on, move, bitch. Yay, we're almost there. But, uh, yeah, so I have to eat. I mean, if my stomach's growling, I can't work out. I just feel like shit. So I'm gonna eat after class. And then, uh, my brother's girlfriend, she goes to college over here, too, so. She wants to get in shape, so she's gonna come work out with me. I say that, she's not gonna fucking work out. I don't think she will. <laughs> I don't wanna do that. It's hard, it's too hard. I used to be a trainer, and that's why I'm not anymore. I get tired of People don't wanna do what you say, man. You tell them, hey, this is what you gotta do to get in shape. They don't care, they're lazy. Most of them are. Man, I don't want to do that. I can't do that. I don't. Every girl. Listen to me, ladies. Listen to me. You listening? You got eye contact? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't care. Damn it. What I say? I told you that was gonna happen. What I say? I told you that was gonna happen. Didn't I? Didn't I? I'm just gonna hold on to it for now. But uh, ladies, I don't know how many times you need to hear this before you understand. You can work out, you can lift weights. You gotta lift weights. Lifting weights, resistance training is great for everybody even old people they need it because they start losing that bone density lifting some weights makes your bones denser it's good for you but uh yeah you can lift weights ladies you can lift weights you can lift a bunch of weights you are not gonna get freakishly huge with big muscles like a man. That is not gonna happen. The only way that's gonna happen is if you take some serious hormone replacement. So you ain't gotta worry about that. Lift weights. 
It's good for you. Look up, uh, what's her name? Jen Selter. It's like Instagram's greatest butt or something like that. I guarantee you. Ooh, I guarantee you that girl do some squats. What's up, dude? <laughs> He's like, what you doing, man? Talking to a camera? Yeah, right. I am. Let's get in the way. But, uh. <laughs> like you studying. Yeah, we made it. Man, we got 30 minutes to spare. But, uh. Yeah, lift some weights. I look up Jen Selter, man. She's got a great ass. Oh, I just want to bite it. <laughs> Jen Selter, if you're watching this, I want to bite your booty. Just not hard. Just leave a little bit of a bruise, maybe. <laughs> but uh, I'm here, and I got to piss because it was a long trip. So that's going to do it for today. Well, I'll probably make another video on the way back. We'll see. See how I'm feeling. Let y'all know how that workout went. But uh, that's it for this morning. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later.